And the supplement review is on the one bars. I just got this in the mail today, ordered it on Amazon. I heard some hype about it, you know. I'm getting sick of eating Quest bars and all that, you know. The, the, the Quest bars are cooling and the macros are all right, but you know, it's just that texture. I can't, it, it's the same with every bar. It's just like, oh, I can't deal. I'm done with them. So this is your anytime guilt-free indulgence, it says. And I looked at the macros and it wasn't too bad for each bar. Um, so yeah, 20 grams of protein, one gram of sugar. So I got the variety box. That's why I got the big boy. It's got 12 in here. Shit, I wonder how much they'd be selling each bar for at like a at like a vitamin shop or a gym. They'd probably be taxing. So I should start doing that. But yeah, so let's crack this bad boy open and see what we're working with today. Gonna open it. Oh shit, this shit is sealed very good. Bear with me, guys. Stickers is, is very um, sticky. So here's the box. So here's the flavors we got. We got the, what is it? I put this in the freezer too. This is gonna be bomb like a candy bar. This is that, um, I guess maple glazed donut. And this has 230 calories, which is it's a little bit high. 23 grams of carbs and 20 grams of protein. Uh, total fat eight, uh, sodium 150, dietary 5B3, soluble fiber three, uh, included fiber at zero, total sugar is one. So it's almost like you're gonna eat like a meal. This is like almost like a little meal, but it's a snack for me. And each calories and stuff varies depending on the bar you use, obviously. Here's that one protein. I mean, what the hell am I saying? This is a uh, almond coconut. Boom. This is 240 calories. It's a little higher. 22 grams of carbs, 20 grams of protein. Total fat, 9 grams. Saturated fat, 7. You know, like I said, this is almost basically like eating a little meal. Like the macros. So, I only eat like, because I'm on a cut right now, so I'm only going to be eating one of these a day. Because I like to... um eat real food oh this peanut butter pie looks bomb this one has 220 calories i'm not gonna go over all the calories for every single one because we'll be sitting here all day but this is the last one anyway so i guess we will 20 grams of protein this is um birthday cake looks pretty bomb 20 220 calories 23 grams of carbs eight grams of fat six grams of saturated fat dietary fiber three Total sugar is one, protein 20. So yeah, that's all our bars right here. I got 12, like I said. I'm trying to figure out which one I'm gonna try first. This peanut butter one looks bomb, but this glazed donut though. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go with the glazed donut. You know, I'm gonna go with, actually, I'm lying, I'm going with birthday cake. So we're gonna go with the birthday cake right here. 220 calories. I'm gonna do the taste right now. I'm gonna do the taste, the uh, texture and all that. I'm ready on the scale from one to 10, okay? So here we go. Bars are pretty big, by the way. It's 60 grams for the, the whole bar. Put it in the freezer, so it's probably gonna be a little tough. But this is how the side of bar looks. It's not bad, it looks not bad. It's all right. So let's give it a taste.
Hmm. Not bad. On a scale from one to ten, I'll rate that. I got six or seven. It's not bad. Better than. <clears throat> Better than the Quest Bars, I'll tell you that right now. And Quest Bars, <clears throat> chewy as hell. This is uh pretty soft, you know, not really that chewy. It's actually pleasant to eat because the texture is not like you don't have to chew your fucking chew your gums off like with the Quest Bars. Got the little sprinkles on top. Oh, it's not bad. I wouldn't say it tastes exactly like birthday cake. But you, can, <clears throat> you can taste the protein in here. It's got like a weird aftertaste. I don't know how to explain it. It's not bad, but it's like, it's like you can taste that this, I guess that's the protein or something in it. I don't know. Really soft though. It's the only flavor I tried, fo. I gotta go through the whole box to like really see if it's worth buying because my other flavors might be better. But as of right now, this one, the texture's good. Taste is like a six out of ten. No. Nah, I'll give it a seven. Seven out of ten. Uh macros, they're not bad. You know, if you're not eating ten of them a day or three of them a day, you'll be all right. You know, just fit it into your macros or however you gotta do it. I'm only gonna eat one of these a day because I like real food. This is like a little snack. Uh so yeah, so far. I mean, this is better than the quest bars, like I said, so. I would definitely rock with these more than I would with Quest. Sorry, Quest, that's just what it is. So if you want, you can check this out. Again, this is the one, what is it? One variety pack. Uh, you can get this on Amazon. Amazon, or you can go right on their website, but I got this shit off Amazon. And um, yeah, when I finish the pack, I'll probably do another review let you know if it's totally worth it or not as of now i think it was like man i'm not sure i think it was like 15 bucks or something like that it wasn't too bad so you know i would recommend try it if you don't know if you've never had it before give it a shot everybody's got different tastes different palettes me so far it's not bad i can rock with it so that's my review on the one bars from, I guess it's one, that's the company. So that's about it. That's a wrap, people. Thank you for watching. Feel free to share, like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. And uh, let me know what y'all wanna see next, what you would like to see me review in the future, or what type of content you would like for me to bring to you. So if you like the workout content, if you like the day in the life content, or you just like the blogs, um, whatever. You know, let me know what's up. and. And I'll do my best to make it happen for y'all. Appreciate y'all. Follow me on Instagram at Muscleville King. And uh, yeah, God bless everyone. Have a great day. Thanks for watching.